Enemy troops inbound! It's a trap! No! What is going on, everybody? Z here, and welcome to Imperion Galactic Survival. I've had this game requested a lot, and it is a survival base building spaceship building planetary explorational bad guy shooting kind of game hopefully you guys enjoy it. we're gonna take a first look at it if you guys enjoy it if you want to see more make sure you leave a comment you'll leave a like on the video that will determine if we continue the series anyways let's go ahead let's start a game now there's single player and co-op so uh we're gonna start with single player co-op might actually be pretty fun in this game uh, i'm pretty excited so survival build fight explore master the galactic survival in your very own way fantastic scenario creative and freedom we're gonna go survival because we want a survival type game. Now, uh, survival single player, uh, game name, new game. Uh, let's go to, uh, it's gotta be Zootopia because that's just how it is. is that, oh no, uh-uh, T's got to capitalize. Zootopia. All right, we're gonna set. Uh, so it looks like there's seeds. Difficulty settings, medium, planet size, medium. Uh, start location for some scenarios you can choose the start location. It will have an impact on the difficulty of your game. Uh, playing it with or without option. Type, playing a difficulty, easy, gravity, basically standard gravity, temperature, zero to 40, radiation, none, atmosphere density, O2 concentration is 20%, heck yes, breathable, yes, fantastic. All right, let's get on into it. So, you can, as far as I know, as far as I've seen, it looks like you can make portals, you can go to other planets, you can do other things, you can craft spaceships, you can go into space. Uh, there are... I, I wonder, are they, what are they called? Xenomorphs or something that were like, that were, that were not friendly. And uh, yeah, we're gonna get on into it. Now, keep in mind that this game has been in early access for a long time. I think it is actually officially released and I'm gonna go land right over here because it looks like there's somewhat of a base already kind of set up. Uh, and I want to, of course, of course, utilize some uh some stuff that's already here if i can because i mean why not absolutely there is a uh it looks like a dinosaur over here <laughs> all right so what do we got now um i played a little bit of the tutorial not a lot but i do have a basic understanding of what's going on versus situation detected blah, 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 blah. protocol initialize proceed uh welcome to the training site oh this is actually gonna uh is it really gonna do is it gonna do the whole tutorial thing because I've, I've done this like i know how to do this okay uh start the journey you really skipped through your life now it's time to find some answers let's go okay awesome oh look at that there's like a like a gigantic tentacle thing coming out of here uh commander just for your reference i've been storing uh our sensor event logs since a pollen station database do you want to retrieve them now um Review them now, not now. Affirmative, I'll continue saving data until you're ready. Okie dokie. Thanks. All right, so I wanna get rocking and rolling with some stuff. So, uh, approach crash site station. I'm tracking a UCH fleet signal sent from a nearby station. It's gotta be this one. Oh, this is a teleport station. Ooh. Okay, the signal source is not here. It's emitting in another position nearby. Okay, hold on a second though. Because like, what do we have? What is this? Can I access this? Identification failed. Uh, please enter valid code to access the first clue. This could be our first clue on what happened to us. Okay. So what do we got here? This is really cool. Or it could be a trap. Uh, warning, it will change your reputation to unfriendly. We'll find out. Wait, what? Press F to access cargo. It will change your reputation to unfriendly with faction Polaris Megacorp. Uh, uh-oh. Uh-oh, <laughs> that, that's not a good sign. I don't want to become unfriendly with anybody, but I feel like we're going to make enemies along the way. Okay, let's go check out this place over here. So, uh, looks like some standard salvage. Nothing too crazy. Let's go ahead and get, uh, let's get our survival tool out. And you know what? Let's go ahead and get energy bars and emergency rations i don't really need emergency rations i think we'll be all right let me grab let me grab this let's get some food in us uh we might need some bandages that guy does not look nice 
That guy does not look nice. Oh my goodness. Okay, let's put these down here. Let's go ahead and heal up. Let's get all healed up and ready to go first. Okay. All right. That's as much as I can heal up. So let's go to salvage and let's start salvaging some of this stuff. Okay. Follow the signal. All right. So I like that you can actually salvage, uh, like these bases and stuff like that. I think it's really kind of neat. Oh, wait, cargo pod. <gasps> oh, computer. Oh, I didn't know that was a cargo pod. Okay. Let's, let's salvage this thing. Cargo box four. I don't think that guy in front of us is very nice. I'm just saying. I don't think that's a thing. I don't think it's a thing. Um, all right. So we have some nodes here. I guess let's. Should we press to. Uh... Oh, should we press onto that? Let's go over here. Oh, that's a kilometer away, though. That's a full kilo away. That's going to be a ways. That's like that's a, that's a ways out there. <laughs> oh, my gosh. <gasps> OK, so we had this area. Was there any other areas nearby? What is this? Salvage? These are all steel blocks, things like that. What is this? NPC core. Polaris Megacorp faction. Um, my guess is that I feel like antenna. Wait, small generator. What? Can I access the small generator? Are we part of the Megacorp? Oh, there's radiation there. Okay. All right. Let's stay away. Okay. We need to get like a little bit of a base place going. That's what I think we need to do. So, uh, let's go up here. Let's look at our tech tree. How many points do I have? Player level one available points unlocked to zero. <laughs> I, know, I can't unlock anything. Okay. I don't want to go that way. Cause I feel like that guy's going to like wreck my face. This is a cool little place to build though. All right. Let's try to take some of these things down. Uh, because we, I, I think we're going to be able to use all these like components to build our own kind of stuff, you know? Okay. All right. All right. We got, we got this whole area taken out. Now, uh, if I go to my inventory, I got a whole bunch of steel plates from that. So I think we can do some base building stuff. Now, do I have, do I have the ability to build? Let's see. Let's go in here. Portable constructor, but I don't have any points available. So we need to do a little bit of drilling and stuff like that in order to get some XP or gathering and things like that. So let's just grab this because I think that gave me that should give me some XP. I don't know if there's an XP bar. That is a really long ways away, though. Uh, you know what? Let's just make our way over there. That is such a long ways away. I really want to get I really want to get the bike. There's a motorbike that we can get. I think we I think we should stick around here and get that first. I think that's what we should do. You know, I thought I saw another like broken down base thing over here. Was there another? Oh, yeah, there's one way over here. OK, let's go over here. Let's see what we got. Z1 Gaming discovered a new POI wreckage. Yeah, I know. Uh, level two reached 10 unlock points. No way. <gasps> Fantastic. OK, uh, portable constructor. Unlock that guy. And let's see here. OK, hold on. Portable constructor. I can make that. That's a portable heater cooler. We don't really need that right now. Let's go to my survival constructor. Uh, portable constructor, iron ore. Okay, so we need some iron ore. Do I have a survey tool? I do have a detector. Okay, let's use this. So I'm looking for resources, 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 wreckage. Uh, something over there. Wreckage, wreckage. I guess is it just resources? Maybe. Let's go check out this wreckage over here. I don't see anything that says iron ore, though. Maybe, maybe we don't know if we get iron ore. Or maybe we just don't know what it is. Like, what's this rock? I don't know what this rock is. I think iron ore is like a, a like a, a brownish material, if I'm not mistaken. All right, let's uh, let's resource mine this guy. Okay, so what do we get here? Hey, we got iron ore. Nice. Okay, hold on. Uh, portable constructor. Cue that up. That's being crafted. Very nice. Oh, I, lo I love starting new survival games and like checking out what's to offer. Uh, I'm kind of I'm kind of excited. I'm not going to lie. So uh, like I said, hopefully you guys enjoy. If you want to check out the game, I will have a link down below. Of course, of course. Let's see. Is there a. 
Is there a, uh, a crate here? That I should be looking for? Let's go to salvage mode. Let's see, that is salvage. Those are just blocks. No crate. It doesn't look like on this one. Okay. All right, we got a... Oh, it's not done yet. Okay. I was guessing I'd get the rest of this stuff. Okay, looking good. Looking good. Now, is that thing done? Heck yes, it is. Okay. So let's just place this down right here for now. And let's get into here. So I want a motorbike construction kit. And we need iron ingots for that. Actually, if I go over here... Motorbike construction kit. If I just bring the iron ore in here... Yeah, motorbike. Heck yes. Okay, so it's going to make the stuff that I need automatically for it. So if I have like the raw resources, it'll actually make and refine the other resources to make the thing that I want, which is super cool. I love that. Uh, and I'm, I'm, I really, <laughs> I really like that about uh, when games do that. It's, it's really fantastic of them. Okay, so let's go ahead and put that in there. We're going to take these out of there. And then let's go ahead and pick this guy up. Perfect. And let's get on our motorbike. Check that out. Oh, I need to change my suit to red. How do I do that? I have no idea. All right. All right. Let's go over here. See, this is so much better. Yes, we had to have a motorbike for this. Oh, shoot. There's water. There's literally dinosaurs here. Those like look like literally dinosaurs. I'm just saying. Um, Is there a way to go around the water? I really don't want to go through the water. Like, anytime you're on any alien thing of anything, water is always a bad place to go. It looks like we can go around this way over here. Now, I don't see any type of fuel source with the bike, and I think that's because the bike is the most basic uh, means of transportation, which is also why it was so cheap because eventually we're going to be making our own like hovercrafts and spaceships and things like that. Darn it. Okay, no, it looks like I can't go this way. Oh my gosh. Oh, what is that thing? Oh, that's gross. The thing was nasty looking. Oh, it looks so grody. It was like a blob with like tentacles walking around. Ew. That thing, what? <laughs> oh, it's disgusting. I guess, what do you expect? Aliens to look cute and cuddly all the time? What, is it supposed to look like slimes from Slime Rancher? <laughs> oh, they're, they're <laughs> there's so many interesting looking things here. Uh, but yes, like I said, I think that there are like, there's factions. And I believe that there's NPCs uh, as far as like ships and stuff like that, that we can go in and we can check out. And like we can actually like raid other things that'll fight back and stuff like that. So I don't, I don't know. It looks like it from the trailer that I saw. It looks kind of interesting. And I'm digging the gameplay so far. The gameplay solid. The graphics are a little dated, but it's it's fun. And I, I like that. Oh, gosh. Oh, those are not nice. I know that. There's no way those things are nice. Oh, gosh. And there's bones everywhere. Oh, I feel like this was a death trip. Okay. Uh, UCH Heidelberg. Please tell me it's like some kind of base thing. Chapter one, human remains. This planet has seen a lot of fights. Yours is only the latest in a series. Track down the UCH fleet signal. IDA is picking up. You'll possibly find the remains of your fellow comrade. Okay, let's go. Uh, I am detecting a U... Oh, what is this? Damaged UCH dart. That is a triceratops. That is literally a trike. Um. Oh, look at this. Yeah, it is totally destroyed. Okay, hold on. So let's get in this small, let's get in here. And if we have P, uh, I think we can, can we not get in the panel? I've marked a possible target for your investigation. Uh, it shows a ma electromagnetic signal. So I thought we could get in here and then hit P to look at the control panel to see what's missing on it. But it doesn't look like it's allowing us to do that right now. That thing is super cool. Okay, we'll have to come back to it. Uh, oh, look at that. What is that huge base right there? Oh, oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. This is, this is like a huge thing. Holy moly. 
EM signal. Let's have a look inside. Uh, we got some plates and some glass. I'm just gonna leave it there for now. Oh, this is, uh, has hit us hard. Kind of a laser projectile or a very adjacent rocket. We got separated from the main fleet. These Xerax have cut us off from the rest. I, okay, Xerax, that is the, uh, the NPCs that we're gonna be fighting, I think. Uh, cut us off from the rest and trying to bring us down. They will be successful. The captain has sent emergency rescue signal. We are making an emergency landing. All engines are off. I am off to the rescue pod. Chief engineer, first class pallet out. Oh, this is totally a base building place. One of the engineers I worked with on my first assignment on the Apollon station. Mm, okay, we got a little bit of radiation here. What's in here? Uh, motors? Oh my gosh. How do I get out of here now? Come on, let me out! Oh, radiation's over there. Okay, maybe this isn't the place to build stuff. What's in here? Uh, a fuel tank? Withdraw fuel? Oh, there's actually fuel in there. Oh. We might have to salvage this place. Okay, let's say this is correct. It is correct. I'm not actually paying attention to what they're saying. I just really want to do the survivally stuff in a base. I want to build a base. I want to do stuff. Uh... It looks like there's all kinds of goodies here for us. I bet you that's a container right there. Oh yeah, combat alloy. I'm gonna take all this stuff soon. I just want to kind of take a peek first, you know? But, okay. It, it, nope, let me up there. Uh, oh yeah, all kinds of stuff. Oh, there's like a upper area too? Oh, I want to make this, uh, I want to make this into my base place. What's in here? More plating. Uh, computers, mechanical parts. I think we should investigate the wreckage more closely. I, I am investigating the wreckage more closely. <laughs> well, that's what I'm doing. That is absolutely what I'm doing. Oh, what is that? Thruster M? Can I pick that up? No, but I probably can disassemble it. While we were at it, I detected electronic... Uh, current nearby. Okay, it wants me to go over here. That's radioactive for sure. Let's see if someone has left another note inside. Where was this electronic current at? Oh! Those are doors! Uh, Captain Brenner and most of the flight team were killed just seconds ago. Projectile hit the bow amidships. I was incredibly lucky. My absolutely justified criticisms made after we ran into this mess caused the lieutenant to send me to check the lifeboats seconds before the bridge was hit. Karma? Maybe not. Now, I can't leave this room. The doors are all sealed. I'm standing in front of the lifeboat section and cannot enter it which doesn't matter anyways, as the whole section is missing and I'm staring into the sky through a big hole in the hole. Big hole in the hole. <laughs> the ground is coming closer. I just heard the tearing of metal. The ship is breaking apart. This might be my final entry into this PDA. I'll put it here. Maybe I'll continue it later. Hope our la our least, hope at least our engineers did the job when creating those structurally strengthens sections. Emerson, Ensign, UCH, Heidelberg. Commander, the optical sensors have detected something attached to one of the machines over there. Strange marker. Okay. Oh my gosh, this is super cool. Like, I, I, I don't know why, but like, the fact that uh, we could possibly just like salvage this stuff and turn it into like a, like a, a base here, that's gonna be super cool. A pad taped on it. Wait, what? It looks like it's written in our academy secret code. Let's see if I can decipher this. Uh, can I start like taking stuff apart here? So let's go to oh oh gosh good luck to us ever reading this season <laughs> let's just do that okay all right so let's do uh salvage okay this is slowly painting the picture a teleporter hmm but no info on where to find it where's this pile of rubble we can find the bridge good news commander i've located the console the writer was speaking about 
Wait, what? Is that the bridge? The bridge of the ship? How do, how do we get into there? We gotta get over there. We gotta get in there. Oh, it's also almost date. It's almost all, almost also dark. It looks like so. Let's see. How am I supposed to? <laughs> how am I supposed to get up here? What? <laughs> Oh, I can jump like super high. Wee! <laughs> oh my god, I got a broken leg. I jumped too high. Uh, uh-oh. Will it heal over time? Oh, I can't I can't even, I can't even jump. Oh no. Do I have to wait for that to heal or do I need to heal it? Oh my goodness. Uh Emergency O2 detector survival tool. Do I have bandages? What do I need for pan plant fibers? I didn't grab any plant fibers. I might be stuck here forever. Okay, I guess I could break my way out. Oh god, those are a thousand? Jeez the waste. Restores uh around 250 health last uh let's see if we can do this. <sighs> Broken leg, health increases. Uh, okay, we still have the broken leg, which <laughs> which means I can't jump. I, can't. I broke my leg in the ship. Oh, no. And I need bandages to get a broken leg fixed. Good gosh. Okay, we're going to have to get out of here. Uh, I don't know which way to go. I guess we'll just go this way. <gasps> use after use medical station. It's medical station type four. Uh, that's actually really cool and it would be really really handy if I could use that right now Not gonna lie to fix uh, Dermal paste endo paste alien parasite radiation Poison fever radiation burn radiation sickness. Oh my gosh. Can we build all of this stuff? Like no way that would be super cool. Okay. I gotta go. I still gotta get out of here though. I need plant fibers in order to To get my uh, my leg fixed Oh wait, I have bandages. Oh my gosh, I'm dumb. There we go. Okay, we're good. We're good. I'm sorry. I had it in my inventory the whole time. I was like, how do I how do I not have those? Okay, I gotta be careful because that's what I did last time. Uh, 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 don't don't break a leg. Good gosh. Oh, armor locker. Oh, there's nothing in it though. Come on! I need to go in the bridge. Okay. Alright, bridge. Bridge console. Uh, I think I need to go this way, maybe. Hold on, let's let's get this cleared out right here. Okay, how do I get to the bridge console? Uh, it looks like maybe right through there. Hold on, let's take this down. Okay, let's see. Can we get right up in here? Come on, come on. Okay, all right, all right. All right, I made it. Bridge console. Please enter validation code AI routine 34. Good luck, survivor. Deactivate console. All right, I did it. Oh my gosh, all of that. Press F to talk to. Please enter verification code. Good luck, survivor. That's it. Uh, where to go? All right. Well, I want to stay here and build a base. That's what I want to do. Do you remember that, uh, the station at the crash site? We should start there. I have marked it on your map. Teleport station. Like, I feel, it. does it not want me to, like, set up camp somewhere? Like, I feel like we should set up camp somewhere. We gotta set up camp, because it's almost dark. Uh, what is this thing? Multi-tool? Uh, I'll take that. Extra multi-tool? Heck yeah. Okay. See what else we got. What's this? Landing gear? Oh, oh, it's on its side. Okay, all right, all right. Makes sense. Makes sense that it wouldn't be uh, chilling right side up. Okay, so it's about to be dark. I have a survival tent. I don't know if things are going to attack me at night, though. And I'm a little worried about it, but let's go ahead and throw it right here for now. Uh, let's put that down. And we'll put that right there. Perfect. Okay, can I sleep now? Yes. All right, sleep till morning. All right, it's morning time. Now, 
Oh, what do we do? Teleport station? I feel like I want to do a little bit of base building, but I also don't want to do, I don't want to do any base building if this is not where I should be doing the base building stuff. I feel like it is though. I honestly feel like it is. You know what? I say we do some base building stuff. Uh, actually, <laughs> I honestly don't even know how to do base building stuff. Base starter, hover vessel starter, uh, starter block for your base, add to toolbar, place with that. Okay, so we need that. Um, oh, that's already unlocked. Those are already unlocked. Okay, ladders, water generator, elevator block, unlock cost, crafting, steel, electronics, optical fiber. Oh. Okay, well let's uh let's get our let's get this placed. And let's see what we need for base building block. O2 tank clone chamber. Oh, sets so a spawn point. Base starter core one okay so we need a core we need this steel plate electronics computer optical fiber oh my goodness but guess what a lot of that stuff is actually right in here so let's grab that and let's get uh let's get something set up because i want to start building a base okay so i went and gathered some things i'm gonna go ahead and put like all of this stuff in here to kind of get an idea of like what i can do with what i have uh all right that looks good now like i said i need a i need a base starter which means i need a core so electronics four computer five uh optical fiber three mm. i don't know that i have that stuff or even am capable of building it okay hold on so electronics four uh, do we have electronics? Electronics require copper ingot and silicon ingots. And then a computer times five. I have... Oh, there's computers right there. Uh, computers are good. Optical fiber. Optical fiber is silicone. Or silicon. Silicon. Copper and silicon. I need copper and silicon. Let's go get copper and silicon. Uh, let's, bust out, let's bust out our tool. Let's do that. Let's see if we found any... There's no resources nearby. no resources anywhere now there's got to be resources here somewhere let's go let's see we can find it we can make it happen uh resource drill what is this guy this looks like silicon silicon bearing yeah so we need silicon and copper oh this looks like a copper is this copper bearing copper bearing perfect okay so i need a bunch of these i'm gonna go around and get some of these guys uh and we'll see what we can do here that thing looks like it wants to eat me. Those things definitely look like they want to eat me. Maybe we should not build a base here. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I figured the thing would tell me. Back to start. Uh, find console. Oh, gosh. It wants me to... <sighs> Maybe I shouldn't build a base here. Maybe we should get back to where we were. But I feel like there's a whole bunch of useful things here. Um, that we could like, we could take down all the steel and make like a whole bunch of stuff. Mmm. Maybe we should just go back there. Lots of useful stuff here though. You know what? Let's go back there. Let's see what the game says. And we'll go from there. Okay. So I'm going to hit, uh, shift F to pick that up. Uh, let's pick up everything. Drop container. Okay. And then let's go ahead and pick up this guy as well. Let's let's get on the bike. Let's head back and kind of go from there. We can always come back. It's not super far away. What's in here? Power coil. Oh heck yeah! See, like there's useful stuff everywhere here. Absolutely everywhere. Oh, you know what? Did my bike despawn? No, it's it's right here. Okay, okay, okay. Cool. Let's grab this. Uh, pick that up. Let's place it back down. And, uh, let's head back. Hey, we're back. Okay, so this is where it wanted me to come to. Uh, Mac to start, find console. Okay, so here's the console that I was talking about. Token code. Please enter token code, uh, access violation. Protocol compromised. Starting self-destruction sequence. What? Oh, jeez. We should leave. 
did it? Oh my gosh. Enemy troops inbound! It's a trap! No! Fail, 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 fail. Wait, hold on. What do the enemy troops look like? Oh my gosh. Mini gun drones? I don't have anything to deal with those. Uh, defense mode. Oh God, no, I'm gonna die. I wasn't ready. I wasn't ready for this. Nope, we gotta go. We gotta go, bike. No, I just died. It was a trap. You were shot by. Is it gonna tell me? <laughs> oh man. Oh no. Warning, you might respawn in deadly environment again. Nearest medical station slash clump chamber. This is a safe option for respawning. Okay. Alright, let's see. Be well equipped in your base. Oh my gosh, it was a trap. Okay, so build a base before that. I probably lost all of my stuff too. What the heck? Wait, what is this place? Uh, what is this place? Oh my gosh, this is a legit base. Wait, so hold on, where? Oh my gosh, I was a really long way. Polaris Megacorp. Defend position. I was supposed to defend the position. I could not defend the position because I was going to die. <gasps> this place is neat. There's a full on like on a, like a, a base place and station. Oh my gosh, there's hydro. There's like a, a, like farms, grow farms in here. <gasps> this is cool. Wait, so where did I, I came? I came out of one of the med stations, huh? What's in here? Oh, there's like bunks and stuff in here. This is cool. I'm not gonna lie. This is actually pretty neat. Um, I'm, I'm pretty surprised by this. Can I go in here? Oh, this is Nita. What is this? Off automated teller machine? Oh, there's like credits and stuff? Wait, what? Like, I feel like this is like very No Man's Sky-esque. Your number one provider of ores and boosts. Press F to talk and you can buy, what? Buy, sell. This is super cool. Pax Purgatory Quartermaster. Hello. Multi-tool. Um, apparently I have no credits this is neat i was not i was not expecting anything like this what is over here there's like there's like stuff there's a warehouse habitat gas refinery medium refinery Oh my gosh, and we, I guarantee we can build all this stuff. What's that up there? A security bot beta? This is super cool. We need to build a base over here. What the heck? This is so cool. Wait, pull warehouse. So can I like... I don't even, I don't, I don't even know. Like, can I buy like, can I buy vehicles like pre-made ones and not have to make them myself? What's that over there? Okay. Those are secure bots. This is too cool. Those look like jerks. Those look like jerks. I'm just saying this is really neat. This is really, really neat. Oh yeah. Those are raptors. Those are aggressive dinosaurs. I'm out. I'm out. No, oh, no, no, no. Guys, uh, there's dinosaurs! 
Let's see how the game try. They're not even gonna protect me! Guys, you're supposed to shoot the thing! <laughs> Those Sakura bots are not working very well. Uh, this is authorized personnel only. Let's go in here. Okay, maybe we can't go in there. Wait, is this the elevator block? Oh. Oh, this is cool. Oh, neato. Okay, all right, let's go back down. Oh, that's really cool. Okay, I see how that works. Guys, take out the dinosaurs. What are you doing? This guy's just walking around. He doesn't even care. He literally just does not have a care in the world. Mm, there's a dinosaur there. It's not attacking me, so I don't care. Okay, so what I think we're going to do here, because I have literally nothing, and I'm not actually sure how to get anything back. Um, I'm, I think I'm just going to reload my last little save that I had, and we're going to go from there. But I think this is going to end this episode. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. What do you guys think of this game so far? It's really interesting. You know, it almost seems like it'd be like a huge multiplayer game. Uh, kind of like No Man's Sky-esque, where you like other players would be in here and doing stuff. Uh, super curious. So I wonder if there's like servers or something for this. Because this is really cool. It's very neat. Stop yelling. Jeez, those, those stupid things. They need to be getting... <laughs> the guards, take them out! <laughs> um... But yeah, it's very cool, very neat. I like it. Uh, leave a comment down below. What do you guys think? Now, my first... Okay, I, I died. I'm sorry, all right? I died. It is what it is. But it was still cool. This is a really neat experience. I'm going to look more into this. And uh, if you guys want to see another episode, make sure you leave a like. Make sure you leave a comment down below. I'm curious. I want to see what this, what this is all about. And uh, yeah, hopefully you guys have a fantastic rest of your day. I will see you in the next one.